NASCAR as parts of America continue to slowly reopen. In Texas, they're allowing restaurants to open starting tomorrow. Laura Ray Dickey is CEO of Dickey's Barbecue Pit. How you doing, Laura? Nice to see you today. Hi. Thank you so much. I'm great. Excellent. So here are the rules, right? 25% capacity, dine-in and patio. <laughs> staff wears masks and gloves, tables at least six feet apart, and the staff is continually cleaning. So how's it going to go, Laura? You know, we hope incredibly well. We are conscientious, but we are cautiously optimistic. It's a little bit dif different for us. You know, we've been doing business here, and I'm in our, our original location in Dallas for over 79 years. Uh, thankfully, we were able to shift um, our business to our online, to our online ordering, our delivery. So we've had continuous operations, but to be able to open the dining rooms back up to interact with our guests, you know, that's part of what that barbecue experience is. And it's a real touchstone for the community. We've been here a long time. Uh, we have a lot of our regulars that come in that just really, this is a third space and meeting space, but we look forward to it uh, cautiously, conscientiously going very well. Uh, well stated. Any reservations here as you get ready for this big step? You know, I think there should always be hesitation and reservation. Um, I think that's how you stay sharp. I think the most important thing is most of what you mentioned. I think, um, you know, we're in an industry that we are professional food handlers. All of our folks are serve safe certified. That's a national accreditation. So I actually think more than some sectors, we're prepared for this. But you should walk into restaurants and dining rooms, and you should see that we are prepared. You should see mm -hmm. hand sanitizer stations by the doors. You should see that tables are set. But again, only to 25% uh, here in Texas. Other places are creeping on up to 50, yeah. but we're at, we're at 25. But you should see it visually that we're ready. Must feel, must feel good to give your employees a job again. Right? It, um, it absolutely does. We have 169 folks that work for us directly here um, in Dallas, and we have been very fortunate uh, because of our online ordering, because of our catering, because of our to-go, but some of our first responder relief programs that we've been able to keep folks on the payroll and avoid a mass layoff yeah. um, compared to a lot of folks, but we've still had to reduce hours, reduce shifts, and so bringing folks back into the dining room, you know, really helps everybody. It helps add those hours back. It really helps grow those paychecks back to a healthy, sustainable Good luck level. To you. Good luck to you. Laura Ray Dickey, thanks for sharing your story. As I say, the customer decides Absolutely. when we open again, right? And you're going to find out Absolutely. tomorrow. Thanks for coming on today. Good luck. Mm -hmm. Moments